Okay, so what's going on YouTube? Hopefully you guys are having a great day. So in today's video, I just picked up Andreas Hem's LUT pack. This LUT pack is crazy. It comes with five brand new LUTs from his own videos. I decided that I would pick it up and review it. And so far, I'm very impressed. I've had it for about two weeks now. So yeah, we're just gonna get into this video. But before that, I'm gonna show you guys a video that I made and shot in New York. Color grade completely with this LUT pack. So without further ado, roll that intro. Okay, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. That was pretty cool. Um, it took like maybe a couple days to make that. I also posted on my Instagram. If you guys want to go check that out, it will be down in the description or on screen right now. So what do I think of the slut pack? First of all, how much does the slut pack cost you? How much is it going to run and does it break the bank? I don't know if I would say it breaks the bank, but it is $36 and it's pretty pricey and it comes with five LUTs. So let's talk about what's included inside the folder when you download it. So when you download this slut pack, you're going to get a zip file and once you unzip that zip file, it will transform into a folder and then you can look at the contents of the folder. So if we open up this folder, Andreas Hemlock Pack, it has four elements, four like folders. First of all, we have elements, which is basically your letterboxes, flares, and stuff like that. Second of all, we have free footage, which is what you saw in the beginning of the video. And then third of all, we have the LUTs, obviously the five LUTs. And then the last thing we have in this pack is an instruction manual. The instruction manual basically includes the best uses of these LUTs and what they are used for or specialized for. So if we open that up, you can see that we will be greeted with this screen and it basically says Andreas Hem LUT Pack. The five LUTs that you're going to be getting is Vulcan. It's basically used for anything and it's his personal favorite, which is actually used in a lot of his vlogs and color grades. Basically a lot of stuff. The second LUT we're going to be getting is Carnage. It's basically a LUT that gives your shots a stylized look. This is best used for beaches, city daylight, and car shots, and it looks very nice. Third LUT is Mandarin. It is perfect for flares and sunset shots. As you can see, he says the perfect LUT for those sunny shots with lots of flares. And then another LUT is Omega, which is actually a classic black and white LUT with some extra punch up its sleeve. That's how he describes it and it's just a black and white LUT with some punch to it. Last but not least, my favorite, Nitro. It's basically for nature and night shots, and it's the perfect teal and orange look. And then obviously it just says use my LUT and uh, send it to me and I might feature you, so yeah. So now we're gonna take some time to look inside of these uh, folders that are included in this. Let's start with elements. When you open up elements, you're gonna get three folders, flares, letterbox, and vignette. If we go to the flares one, it has a couple of flares. You have this blue one, an orange one, sun flare left, and a sun flare right. The great thing about these LUTs is that they are already transparent backgrounds, PNG files, and you can basically just slap it onto your footage and you won't have to change the blend mode to screen or anything like that. Now the second thing inside elements is letterbox. Letterbox is basically those black cinematic bars that you put around your footage. I'll put some letterbox bars around this footage and yeah, that's what it looks like. And then the third thing is vignette, which is basically just this. I'll put it on top of my footage and my face right now. It basically just makes those corners more darker while everything else is its original form. So yeah, that's the elements folder. Next folder is free footage. I'll play some of that free footage on screen right now. Really cool. We have a sunset one, um, one at a concert called Pyro, Castle Shot, Tom shot, which is his friend, and then a snowman shot, and then we also got a bear and some more lights at a concert. And then the third, last but not least, folder is LUTs. These are all LUTs. You got Carnage, Mandarin, Nitro, Omega, Vulcan, and Flat. One thing that I like about this is he actually included a flat LUT, so if you don't shoot in the S-Log or any log profile, you can drag this flat LUT on top of your footage and then put on one of his LUTs because these are made for S-Log footage. So yeah. It's uh, really cool, it includes a lot of stuff. Now let's hop into post-production and see how these work. So for the sake of this video, I'm gonna be using some of his free footage that he included. Again, if you would like to see a video that was graded with these LUTs, you can actually check out the one in my Instagram. Okay, so then now that I am in the editing program, we're using Premiere Pro. If I drag in some of his free footage, I'm gonna drag in this sunset clip. You can see that this is basically the basic look that it comes out of camera as. Okay, so now to me, it looks like it was 
was recorded on a red analog profile. So what we're gonna do is go down to new item, adjustment layer, hit okay. We're gonna drag this adjustment layer on top of our footage. I'm gonna click on that and we're gonna go color. Now go to the creative tab. The reason I like doing this is because you can change the intensity of the look once it's on the footage, instead of not being able to do that in the basic correction color tab. When we go to creative and we go to look, go to browse. Now we're gonna go to that Andre's Home Look Pack and we're going to go to LUTs. And since Mandarin is for sun shots and this is like a sun flary shot, we're gonna use Mandarin. And then boom, automatically, changes it pretty drastically. We can do some stuff like add contrast to it to make it more contrasty. Maybe even bring down the exposure. Maybe even change the temperature to make it more cool or more sunny. But yeah, that looks really cool. Awesome silhouette shot. And as you can see, if we do the before and after, it's pretty drastic. I think that's the word I was looking for. I don't know. Tell me down in the comments if you know. So now if we drag more free footage in that he gave us, I'm gonna use this light shot because this is a really cool blue shot. Believe it or not, this was actually recorded in a log profile. What I'm gonna do is drag another adjustment layer by making one again, dragging that on top of this footage and going to browse, nitro, boom. Look at that, that's actually crazy. But uh, yeah, I like it a lot. It's uh, pretty cool, boom. Such a drastic change teal and orange and just to make this a little bit more realistic we're gonna drag down uh kind of make it more blue and after doing that this shot looks absolutely insane so yeah these lots are very worth it 36 dollars they are pricey but in my opinion they are pretty worth it they're probably going to be the lets i use on everything and so far i've used them on about 10 projects and that's been just two weeks so definitely go pick these up. They are $36. I will leave the link below. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you're new and have never seen my content before. I'll see y'all in the next video. I've been Matthew and you guys have been awesome. And yeah, peace. Stop.